So I'm here today at Hong College trying my hand at precision machinist ing. Hi, how are you? Hi. I'm Dylan. Hi Dylan, my name is Ken Muirhead and I'm the learning manager of the Precision Machinist program. So you'll be showing me around? Yes. Okay. Follow me. All right. This is Jeff. Hi Jeff. Hi. Dylan. Dylan, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Jeff's going to be your guide today. Okay. It's a uh, safety first in the in the shop here. So this is where we're starting? We're here with the bandsaw here and we're going to cut some material. You crank that down, turn it like that until it gets tight. really tight, until you can't move it anymore. See, what I find really hard to turn might be different than what you find That's really all right. hard to turn. So you couldn't do this by hand, or could you? You could, it would just take an awful long time to do, so this, it really speeds up the process. What are we making again, or a dovetail or something? A dovetail slide, so dovetail. basically we're gonna make a couple of parts that fit together, and they're gonna slide with very good accuracy, we hope. So, Does the all. machine turn off on its own? Or do it you? automatically stops. Cool! So the odds of losing a finger are very slim. As long as you're, you know, very safe and you don't put your hand in there while the machine is moving. Ugh. Now we're going to move over to the mill and we're going to start cutting. Oh, you think? All right. This is the milling machine. There you go. Should it be smoother than that? No, that's perfect. So it's very smooth part now. Uh -huh. And we'll rotate it forward, cut this side, and then, and then rotate, we'll cut that side, and and cut that side, and then it's gonna be perfectly square. So now, we're gonna replace this cutter. Okay. Lefty Lucy, righty tidy. The other way. Oops. The other Lucy. So the, the left? The other righty. Oh. Is this right? This left, way. right. Oops. My right. bad. You didn't see that, we can edit that part out. So we're almost mm -hmm. there. Am I touching? Close. Keep going until you can't move anymore. Rotate it this way a little bit, and then you'll start hearing the tool cutting on the mill. That's perfect. Natural. Now that part's done. We can move on to the last operation on this part, where we get to drill and tap a hole. All right, now we're ready to thread that hole. All right, that should be good. That's through? Yep. Is this the last part? Oops. The second last part. Okay. And you can grab the part out. Oh. There you go. Take the other part we made. Now we'll head off to the lathe and we'll make the final part. Okay. So there's, right. there's one Slides more Slides right in there. Look at that. Perfect. So this is a different metal. It's a, this is steel. So it's going to be a little harder, harder to, to cut. Harder to cut. Smoke coming off it. Pretty crazy. Stinks. Yeah, the first oh, I see what's happening. I didn't understand. It's yeah. shaving stuff like off the outside? It's shaving stuff off the outside and it's making the part concentric. So now it should be a perfect circle. Oh, very cool. Where is it supposed to fit? In, in the that? bottom. Oh, so you have to take a lot earlier. off then. So we still got quite a bit to go. Hi guys, how'd you get along? Pretty well. I think it made perfectly. Is it good? I think. I think maybe. Let's check it out. So that's for thickness? That's for thickness. It has that to. Has to it has to assemble. Right there we go. You can feel how close the fit is. Yeah. And then the taper on the turn part, right? It has to fit a mating part. So that's good. That's very good. So do I pass? You pass. What do I get? Like a 99? We're talking a hundred here. That's probably about a 90. A 90? <laughs> What did I do wrong? Nothing. We don't. <laughs> he just doesn't give hundreds. That's it. That's rough. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you, Jeff. Thank you. You're a lovely teacher. Appreciate it.